we have is two mobile computers. Mm -hmm. um, it's just a straightforward mobile computer that runs off a of 12 volts DC. Um, it's running Windows XP. Um, but the kind of the magic of it all here is we're using a Samsung Express card. Um, this is actually provided to us by Zoom, and we'll be utilizing the Zoom network today. Um, and this is the same product that's being uh, commercially offered in Baltimore with their with their launch. Um, other than that, there's been no other modifications, or actually there are no modifications to the computer itself. Um, it's just, again, running standard Windows XP. Um, we do have a GPS receiver that'll make sense in a few minutes. But, but um, what it's just to simply demonstrate that, you know, if you will, an application such as, uh, and again, there we go, an application such as, you know, streaming audio, something very simple mm -hmm. um, in a mobile environment, all of the applications that you're going to see today have not been modified or changed any way for the mobile environment. These just picking them right off the web. Standard internet access type stuff or um, right off the web. And the only thing we've really done is we've kind of, with the touch screen here, we've just kind of made it a very iconic. Um, we found that driving with a keyboard is not the easiest thing to do. <laughs> Although we do have a keyboard available if you'd like to jump there. <laughs> I think that's a like that's a thousand dollar fine in California. <laughs> yeah, oh. I think they're comparably seen in Baltimore right now on their network there. Yeah. Um, certainly in in Portland, Oregon, on our network, um, the Clearwire network. Um, we don't necessarily have it set up for uh, services yet, so we're seeing speeds in the teens and things of that nature. Sitting in my um, living room in Seattle, Washington. Um, but what, what the intent of this is, again, kind of demonstrating that ultimate shift in place and time. Right. And again, a readily off-the-shelf consumer product such as Slingbox that you can, you can use in a mobile WiMAX environment. Um, without any modification or changes like that. So, you know, being familiar with it, you know, you can do everything from, you know, changing the channels, you know, um, if that's something that you would like to do, to, in, you know, my case, it's a it's a full DVR that's hooked up to a DirecTV DVR, and I can look at the, the different channels that, you know, or different programs that I've recorded, right. you know, or and or set up recording, uh, if that's something that I would like to do while I'm, you know, mobile or on the road. You know, things that you might do while you're mobile, gas, food, lodging, um, that you would, you know, want to look into. And so, you know, you may want to choose food or something like that. And what, what's convenient is, you know, not only is it, you know, kind of mapped, it's very contemporary. You can see advertising that right. might come with that, that's, that's that. But in the context of, you know, like a, a business or something like this pizzeria, is you can actually pull it up here and say, okay, you know, I've obviously never been there, but I, okay, you know, eat the bread, you know, eat the breaded steak sandwich. You know, you can actually see the live testimonials and, and those type of comments, mm -hmm. as well as um, through a very simple Skype application, you can click through in here. Is that us, the dot, moving on the map? That's that, us, that, the dot. Yeah, that is quite literally us, the dot, moving on the map. Let me move that away there. That's kind of fun to see, isn't it? Mm -hmm. Oops. And let me just street live um, question. Right. The ability to actually show live traffic video. Live and, traffic um, cams. Now imagine we're in Portland, Oregon. Right. <laughs> Transport ourselves. All right, it's going to be a long drive. Uh, and, yeah, He's ready. But, and we, you know, but what we, what the demonstration we have set up actually brings in the live traffic streaming video from Oregon. And yeah. if you imagine with presence, knowledge, being able to tie to the specific cameras to your route, or if you will, a navigation system, being able to pull up those cameras to say, well, you know. What does yellow really mean? Yeah. You well, mean, yellow really means that. So the end of having to listen to 10-minute updates on the radio. The, the strength of the the, uh, the WiMAX experience is that we don't require any special modification. This is, you know, like I said, I'm kind of over-saying it, but, you know, this is standard off-the-shelf Internet type stuff. Yeah. So we're not requiring that you, you utilize a specific type of, you know, technology or browser technology or anything of that nature or adapt your coding or anything to, to work in a mobile environment. The phone call was a Skype phone call. That's a Skype application that you can download yourself and run. This is, you know, Internet Explorer going to KATU's website. It's like cut reports. Oh, oh reports, I'm sorry. There you go. Me. <laughs> Live and direct. 124 more than hey, can I order that WiMAX report?